Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to be putting door sills on my car. Um, they're particularly good for preventing like scratches and damage to the paint. Like that. So, I'm just going to be showing you guys how to do it. In case you guys want to do it to your own. So the first thing you want to do is get everything ready. So I got isopropic alcohol, paper towel, the door sills, and something to heat the glue up a little bit, a heat gun. That way it adheres better. So, first thing you do, you gotta prep the surface. Because if you don't do it, get it clean enough, the glue won't hold. I'm being pretty liberal with the alcohol because it dries quick. It's not going to hurt your paint. And I just keep going till eventually there's nothing left on the paper towel. So now that the surface is nice and ready, I'm going to peel back this double sided tape. Now, whatever you do, don't heat the paint. You could end up damaging it, so heat this instead. So I'm throwing the heat gun over this. That's going to cause that glue to get more, more sticky. I mean, you'll have better adhesion. Okay, and then. Place it center right there and firmly press down. Now mine's metal, so be careful about heating this too much. So this is very warm to the touch right now. So you just want to be careful of that. And I'm pressing down, they recommend about one minute. So I'm just putting my body weight into it. And then I just constantly move my hands around a little just to create different pressure points. You could also do it like this if you got really big hands like me. Okay. Now, after that's all done, I'm gonna wanna test to make sure the door closes properly because they're a little bit big and it closes just fine. And then that's all there is to it. The back, so the long ones are gonna go on the front and the smaller ones, as you can tell, these are gonna go to your rear seats because you have less room back there. All right, everyone, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.